bucks. Uh, can you elaborate a bit on what it means to be a bunker trader? I imagine it's quite different to the type of trading C trader is used for. Yeah, absolutely. You're you're correct. C trader is a specialized FX CFD trading platform. Uh, bunker trading is bunkers are basically the fuel that a ship uh, burns. And they still call it bunkers to this day. So a bunker trader is responsible to first of all find supply from a supplier uh, at a various port um, and have it loaded onto onto the vessel. So you are exposed to the price of, of oil because it's you know the, the marine fuel oil is a derivative of crude oil. Uh, so you always have a you know a, a price up on your screen and probably some different prices for different ports. But it's it's a very low risk business in a way that you immediately lock in uh, some spread. So you're buying from a supplier and on the spot selling to the the vessel uh, with some credit. That's that's your added value, and you're making a, a small, a very small percentage. So most of these firms work with like 1.5 percent uh, profit. So it's not much. Oh, so bunker is the fuel that you sell. Okay, I, I thought it was like you're in a bunker and you're trading and you're just like. Let me focus. Well, that uh, that might be cool, though. That that might be a cool show for Twitch. I'll tell you that. <laughs> yeah, can you ha having all your screens open and uh, swearing at everybody as you trade. Uh, isn't that what happens when you play video games? Eat that, you little. There you go. <laughs> and you're probably talking to a six-year-old kid on the other end. He's probably mm -hmm. talking harder smack back to you. And then you go down, and then you go hard on that kid, and then his mom's listening. He's like, "What are you saying to my kid?" Right. But, yeah, uh, I, that's. I guess that's where the next generation of traders are going to evolve is through Twitch. Yeah, hundred percent. There's there's a lot of traders that are streaming, uh, especially in in crypto community. They just live stream and, and trade. And there's you know there's. I mean, I can't do it personally. I don't like watching other people trade. I find it like you know watching paint dry. But I, I guess there's an audience for that. Yeah. Maybe that's another uh, business for uh, Jeff Bezos to spin off of from his flywheel over there. Uh, he's like, sees everybody trading video games. He owns Twitch. Right? So yeah, yeah, they, they bought him out. That's right. What What isn't he going to wow. own over there? Apparently he owns everything. Pretty much. They remind me of like Rakuten. Rakuten's involved with everything. They also do trading as well. Oh, yeah, yeah. Massive, massive brokerages. Oh, yeah. That's that side of the world. Definitely. Matt, have you ever speculated on the oil and gas sector? I don't I don't think you've traded bunkers, but No, I stay away from oil and gas just because uh people using it is just decreasing every year so I wanna be in disruptive tech, not really disrupted tech. Got it. And Alex, what, do you see it, what happened to uh, to tankers? Uh, or it must have been fun trading when the uh, oil went to negative forty last year. Yeah, yeah, that was that was insane. I mean, I, I wasn't. Uh, I'd already left bunkers uh, a while ago, um, but I I did contact some like ex trader uh, friends and colleagues, and it was it was just absolutely insane. Uh, and you know, some brokers had massive massive losses because of this. Oh yeah, and the, I don't think anyone could buy at minus forty, right? They did, they made it like uh, well, the, uh, like interactive brokers, um, their charts were never designed to go sub zero, so they just broke and the quotes broke, and, and therefore they actually had to uh, eat the loss for for the clients because the client could not execute on the interface. They actually handled it very well, interactive brokers. I gotta give them kudos for how they handled that. They ate it. They're yes. they're a well capitalized company, and they I think they did what was right in that matter. Hundred percent, hundred percent, yeah. Uh, 